guys, this is Simon Sage from Android Central. We are at CES 2013 checking out Sensa. This is a concept tablet by Synaptix. They do a lot of really great uh, touchscreen technology uh, and a lot of phones you might recognize back there. But uh, this tablet here is uh, something new. Uh, we got Andrew Shu uh, from Synaptix who's going to walk us through this. How's it going, Andrew? I'm doing good. So this is our Sensa concept tablet um, in the fine tradition of our other concept prototypes such as Onyx, which was the first uh, touchscreen um, handset concept as well as the Fuse. And what we chose to do um, this year with the Sensa uh, tablet was to explore one of the, um, what we believe is the up and coming uh, industrial design trend of tablets, which is losing the borders. So we literally created a tablet here with very minimal borders uh, that only go to the extent of the LCD border. And we just, um, decided to think, well, what kind of problems would this incur? Well, the first one that you'll notice is when I put my thumb down here, um, there's really no place to hold the tablet anymore. So um, this immediately got us thinking about what can we do to look at what uh, to attack this grip sensing issue. So we added uh, two sensors uh, that you can't see in the back here um, that are also multi-touch uh, sensors to allow us to actually um, see what um, the tablet is seeing on the back when you're touching it. And and this program here can show you, it's very faint, it's, um, my fingers touching the back. And so when my thumb comes down in the region around those fingers, you can actually see that it's being reported as what's called a back touch. Um, a grip touch. Well, the primary finger will continue to be reported as a primary navigation finger. And what this allows you to do is to write applications that take advantage of the script data. So here we wrote a little bit of an ebook reader program. And first of all, let's see, if we turn off the grip sensing. Hold on a second. So the grip filter is now turned off. When my thumb comes down, first of all, it hides the text that is underneath it, so you can't read it. But second of all, when you try to scroll, all of a sudden, the primary finger actually becomes a pinch operation instead of a page turn. So let's turn the grip sensing back on. And so now when my thumb comes down, it actually pushes the, the text over to the side here. Let's see. And now, when I try to turn the page, it works as it should. We have a couple different ideas of what to do with the margin. This one is um, a bounding box, and then this one literally follows the outline of your finger. And you know, this is a way to improve the usability um, and also to visualize, you know, a uh, grip operation being uh, used so that there's no ambiguity about which finger is your um, grip and which finger is actually doing the navigation. Okay, I mean, that, that's totally awesome. I mean, I, I think it's kind of a given that most tablet manufacturers are, are looking to reduce the bezel size, but are, are getting a, a lot of interest in manufacturers wanting to put touch sensors on the rear of their larger devices? Well, I can let you in on a little secret, which is that when we previewed this to an OEM, they literally thought that this product was ready to go. <laughs> Obviously, there's still a lot of work that needs to be done um, in terms of how to instantiate um, this idea at the three different levels. So the hardware, obviously, is something that's Synaptics is very comfortable in designing uh, with, you know, as far as custom sensors uh, for any type of um, application. Uh, it's going to be the driver and the applications, of course, that are going to be a little bit more um, challenging in terms of trying to make them a little bit more production worthy. So, you know, we certainly are looking forward to working with OEMs on implementing these ideas because we think it's absolutely, you know, essential to improve uh, next generation uh, device usability, um, you know, given these uh, trends that uh, we're seeing with uh, the hardware. Absolutely. Well, great. Thanks a lot, Andrew. All right. You're welcome, Simon. Take care.